Yeah. We had a blast in Berlin. We've said, and I swear, I'm not just saying it because we're here. You could read other interviews where we were not here and said that Berlin is our favorite leg of the shoot. Um, we love the city. We had so much fun. Um, and I think that, you know, some of the dark, ominous architecture really adds an amazing element to our movie. Uh, I think it benefited greatly from shooting here. We shot in these tunnels that were made on a soundstage in Atlanta. Um, you know, it was much harder for Liam. He couldn't stand up straight for 12 hours a day. Um, and just, we, we were just soaking wet all day, which was hard, you know, um, and just exhausting doing those stunts with, with your, when your clothes are waterlogged, you've got an added 20 pounds. It was really difficult, but I think it paid off. Those, those, the scenes are, are phenomenal. Um, and the tunnel, Francis um, really, really nailed that with making it terrifying and emotionally driven and captivating. Um, so I, I can safely say it was worth it, but I did get Roundhouse kicked in the face, so that wasn't fun. It is interesting because being 15, I think that I've, I've had the opportunity to be able to talk to a lot of the fans that are, that are close to my age, and it's been really inspiring for me um, reading the books. Like I said, they, they really kind of made me think and made me question things, and that's something that I think all young people want and need, is something to to inspire them. For me, I think it's a real feeling of satisfaction and uh, accomplishment. You know, it's um, these movies have been last you know, four or five years of our lives and characters that we've been with for a long time. And mm. it's cool when you get to do a, a kind of a saga type thing because you get more movies to sort of explore a character and, mm. and show different moments. Um, but it's, it's, you know, it's, it's bittersweet. It's, it's, it's sad to say goodbye to working with these people. You know, mm -hmm. we, we still see each other around and about, but... Uh, it's different when you're not in the sewers for hours and hours and hours on, on days on end. You know, one of the best things I'll take away from this is I made such good friends. You know, Jen and Josh and then the entire rest of the cast. And, and we had such an amazing crew the entire time as well. And uh, I think that'll be something that I'll always miss is, is just being able to work with such a good group of people. It was such an extraordinary group, and they were so wonderfully inclusive, which was a big surprise. That doesn't happen all the time when you walk into an established cast. And, and uh, I, I really enjoyed um, being a part of it and, and meeting these people and also being a part of something that's such a global phenomenon. I still feel like I've grown so much sort of over the last few years, you know, as an actor, and I've sort of had the opportunity to work with you know, some of my heroes, you know, growing up watching these guys on the big screen, all of a sudden you're sort of rubbing shoulders and as Josh pointed out, you know, running through sewers and banging heads on pipes. And, you know, it, 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 it really does, there's a bond that we all share, an experience we've all lived through. And, you know, I, I, I think that's, that's uh, invaluable, really. Like, I feel like I've grown, I suppose. I think, quite, quite honestly, that the, the movies and the stories, the books, are about the consequence of war and the, the consequences of, of violence. Um, I think those themes really come into play with this movie. And I think it's this story and this movie that sort of gives the series, uh, the entire series, its, its meaning. Um, I think they're timeless ideas, unfortunately, because these kinds of things, things that are happening in the world now, have been happening for thousands of years. And Suzanne Collins, you know, based a, a lot of the stories on Roman history and actual battles and actual, you know, stories and narratives that took place then. And they've been happening since. Um, so, yes, there are definitely parallels to things that are happening around us. There is a sweet feeling that I have. I have to say that I feel, you know, completely creatively fulfilled having worked on these movies. Um, it's... It's very satisfying to do this last film, especially because of the closure that it has and to see the history of the characters and the relationships all come to, to an end um, is really pleasing for me. So I'm happy for the fans to see that, uh, but it's, it's gonna be sad to say goodbye to everybody. Mm -hmm.